y'all doing? We back on the grillio. We're gonna make some barbecue smoked burgers. If I don't fall down. If he don't fall down. <clears throat> the first thing we're gonna do is take this small Vidalia onion and we're gonna grate it on the small side of the cheese grater. Because a lot of people like the flavor of onion, but they don't like the texture. Go figure. I like the texture. I want big chunks of onion in yeah, mine. I do too. I like this onion. Yeah, you know. But when you do grate it, here's a, a couple pluses. You get all that juice and stuff. Yeah, this is pretty labor intensive. Yeah. Why on the small side? Because look at what it creates. It gives you kind of onion mush. Slush, yeah. That means that when you bite in that burger, shit gonna drain down your arms. It's gonna be juicy. Stuff gonna drain down your arms. True, that too. Yeah. Ooh, you can smell them, man. I know, right? Yes, I'm gonna grate this whole onion, y'all. It's gonna be boring. But I'm gonna film the whole damn thing. I wish you could smell it. It's strong. It gives that oniony flavor, mm -hmm. aroma, scent. You've been doing it for a minute and 40 something seconds so far. It's getting kind of aggravating. We're gonna film you doing that. If whole... you have a food processor that mm -hmm. does that, mm -hmm. it's a lot more gooder. A bit more gooder, huh? Yes. I think that's enough onion. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Hey, get what's in there. Oh yeah, gotta get all that goody out of there. Yeah. That's a lot of onion. All right, these are chipotles. Diced chipotle peppers. They got a little bit of adobo, adobo sauce in here. Not much, but a little bit. We did burgers last night at Matt's. I love me a good burger. With some sriracha on it. Oh, sriracha's so good. It is really good. Yeah. And Matt is going to come over and show us how to do it. the uh, Burger Meister the correct way. Put a little bit of Heinz Kansas City barbecue sauce up in there. Got that much. That's uh, three tablespoons. Okay. And your favorite barbecue rub, which ours is LeBlanc's Guns and Roses. Guns and Roses, really good. Straight from Gonzales, Louisiana. Did Ryan bring that to you? Yes, he did. Awesome. I'm going to say that's four heaping tablespoons. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to mix this up with our favorite utensil, which is... Them hands right Them there. Them hands. I'm kidding. That's not what they really said. Let me turn my damn ringer off. Putting all these flavors in your burgers, y'all, will make them like over the top. Yeah, you can add whatever you want, cheese, yeah. whatever. Just you can you put whatever you want in there. We're going to put cheese on top of these. Burger. Blah, 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 blah. I'm going right, to put cheese so in. I'm going to put cheese on top We're going to break that in half. We're going to break each half in half to make four quarters. Then we're going to break each quarter in half. Here, Hazel trying to get to the fence. Yes. Did you fix it? I did. She's Thank trying. you, zip ties. You're trying to damage. Thank you, zip ties. <clears throat> uh oh. Did she just climb it? Oh, she can climb a fence. I know, I'm just listening to her over there. Alright. We're going to make patties out of this. And uh, we're going to cook her on the Master Belt, right? Yes, we are. The Master Belt Gravity Fed Smoker Grill. I'm gonna say each one of these patties are about a third of a pound, judging by how much ground chuck we started with. 
So we're going to come back, y'all, when we get all this made up. and Yes, we'll come back when we put them on the grill. Yeah, see y'all in just a few. Thank you. I saw the countdown mm -hmm. that time. Oh, that back, y'all, we're going to put a little dusting of this uh, <laughs> Guns N' Roses, all these burgers. I got the smoker set at about 265, which is actually 275-ish. We're going to put these burgers on here. A piece of ash flaked off the lid. Some are bigger than others. You know, that's that's a home patty right there. Yeah. That's a home patty. There's a uh, some charcoal briquettes in there, royal oak. And there's a few hickory chunks in there. Yeah. So they're gonna get a good smoky flavor. These burgers, when we bite into them, will have a pinkness to them. That will be a smoke ring. Cool. We're gonna shut the lid, put these babies to sleep for about 20 minutes. Then we'll be back when we flip them. Yep. All right, y'all, we're gonna flip these. Like I said, we cook them kind of low and slow, about 275 degrees. They got barbecue seasonings, barbecue sauce. That's gonna be a widow bitty one right yeah, there. That's gonna be bigger. We'll come back in about 10 minutes. Bothering you yet? We'll come back in about 10 minutes and we're gonna sauce them, let that sauce caramelize, and then we're gonna put some sliced cheese on them and let them melt. It's low and slow, it's smoked burgers. It's barbecue burgers. Mm -hmm. So, you know, low and slow, barbecue sauce, barbecue seasoning, all those flavors. There's some hickory chunks in there. We're getting all that barbecue wood. When we cut them open, you'll see a, a smoke ring in them. Oh, so, good. yeah, we'll be back in 10 minutes. Okay. Peace. All right, y'all, here is the basting part, or the brushing part. A little bit of a Heinz, Kansas City on each one. Where's your breath? You got it? It's right beside me. Yeah. And we're gonna let this caramelize for about eight more minutes. We want that sauce to get all broken down and caramelized and, and good and stuff. And we're gonna serve this on a bun with nothing but some cheese. Actually, we're gonna come back in five minutes and put cheese on these. Some sliced Gouda. Why Gouda? Why not? It's Gouda. That's Gouda. <laughs> you gonna toast the bun? No, no toasted bun. Throw right it on your hand. Be back in five. Miss Becky did that. Mm. She's special. Mm. Oh, y'all, look at that. Look at it. Look at it. This is some Gouda that I sliced. I'm going to put two slices on top of every patty. Unless, unless we run out, because, you know, you put a bowl of cheese in front of folks, they're going to eat that snack. piece of cheese yeah. or bowl of cheese. I'm putting one slice on those because those are really bitty patties. They're what? With the bitty patties. One more time. With the bitty patties. Okay. Are you satisfied now? No. Are you a, um, yes, I am. Yeah. Just leave it at that. Yep. All right, y'all. We're going to give that five minutes. We're going to come back. Actually, we're going to come back when we're trying them. That's what I was thinking, yeah. Yeah. I got some buns in there. We're going to put a little bit of barbecue sauce on the buns. This is a barbecue burger. You got any more barbecue ranch left over? I do not have any barbecue ranch left over. Mm, okay. But we will make barbecue ranch soon. I'm sorry. That's fine. I was just going to dip some trout in with some barbecue ranch. You're too. pretty. Not really. Eh, a little bit. Anyway. Except for the gray hair in your beard. Yeah. Which, by the way, I'm getting a lot of gray hair in my beard now. Mm -hmm. I did trim it. Normally, when I trim my beard, Jamie would be like, 
Did you dye your beard? Yeah, because I think you dye your beard. No, I do not. You just won't admit it. No, I would admit it. I'm turn that off when it's right in your eyes. We'll be back when we're trying a burger. Yep. Peace. I think it's tasting time, y'all. Mm -hmm. We're going to put a little bit of barbecue sauce on here. This is a barbecue burger. Put a little bit on the top bun. <clears throat> you want a big patty? No, that one. That one? That one. Okay. They're all with that person and they know why. I got Hazel. Hazel's like, drop one. I'm going to have a little bitty patty. And I'm going to show it all the way to the back because I can't eat much. Yes, I washed my hands. It's all right, we've been drunk together before. Like tonight. Like it's all. All right, y'all. Let's see. Oh, holy shit. No steam coming off that. Oh my gosh. Can you see the smoke ring? Mm-hmm. I like it. That's really good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. It's tender, juicy, has that smokiness. Mm -hmm. You can taste that hickory in it. You can taste that barbecue seasoning. You can taste that barbecue sauce. You can taste that gouda. Yo, slow smoke a burger. Yeah. They don't have to be hot and fast. They don't have to have a sear on them. Slow smoke a burger. It's, it's, I like them better than a hot and fast burger. They really go. Yeah. Mm. Well, that being said, this will be up soon, and we'll alert everybody. Huh? This will be up soon. We'll alert everybody. Yeah. Y'all, we love you. We appreciate you. Button, button, knob. Yep. Or button, button, bell. Yeah, either way. Button, button, knob. Yep. Whatever. No. Smoke a burger. Yep. Smoke a hot dog. We'll do smoked hot dogs very we'll soon. Smoked hot dogs, yeah. Yeah. See you next time. Love you guys. Peace. Yep. Good.